It's a loss that's hard to take. The Sacramento Fire Department now mourning one of their own this holiday season. Just as hard for them to bear that loss considered a, a line of duty death. The CBS 13's Ryan Hill has much more on the department trailblazer and how Sac Fire is remembering her in a story you'll only see here on CBS 13. Tough, candid, and caring. Touching words from Sacramento Fire Captain Keith Wade about firefighter Tamara Thatcher. There was always a smile on her face. She was always excited to be at work, and she always uh, served the community with just a passion. Long before Wade became a captain, Thatcher was one of his training officers at the fire academy. He says he'll never forget the time she shared some words of wisdom to him and others during boot camp. She was kind of giving us the down and dirty of what to expect going in as a, as a probationary firefighter. And um, I always thought <clears throat> when I look back, that was pretty cool of her. The veteran firefighter was one of only a few women in the department. She died from occupational cancer this week. A death her fellow brothers and sisters hope never has to happen again with equipment and procedures. Chief Gary Loesch says things like an extricator, which is a specialized washer meant to rid firefighter uniforms of harmful materials, can help. Something called clean cabs are also on the way. We would have all our bunker gear and our SCBAs, which is like those air tanks you see us wear, they would actually be in the cabs of the fire trucks as we were responding to incidents. Now a clean cab means that they have to be eliminated from the cab. Wade tells CBS 13. Thatcher helped break the mold and paved the way for women to think about answering the call. Especially her later years, traveled working in different programs up and down the West Coast, um, going to uh, female firefighter camps, letting the youth know that, hey, this is, a, this is an option for you to be a firefighter. Such a loss, the department says it is now finalizing a plan for a memorial. Plans are expected to be announced sometime next week.